Well, we're here today to be doing Kali Dash's first omelet. That's the name of the recipe. Now come on over to the stove. Now what I've done here, if you look in here, what I've done is sauteed some mushrooms ahead of time with some onions. I read about this in a novel. I read about a novel, somebody ate a mushroom omelet and it made me want to make one. And so what I've done is sauteed some mushrooms and sauteed some onions. Then after they're done, you add the egg. Now. This mushroom omelet is going to have um, mushrooms advertised on it. The way that it works is that when you see it, you see the mushrooms. It's not some surprise. You know, you open it up and find something you don't like. You know what's going to be in it from the outside. What I'm also going to do for balance is have a salad. Always have a salad when you eat eggs or any animal product. Always have a salad. And what I put on it is flax oil for the brain, organic apple cider vinegar for digestion, and salt. Pink salt, quantum pink salt for the adrenals. This will help you avoid headaches if you take plenty of this a day. Now, let's get back to our omelet. What I've done here is allowed it to slow cook. Coat the bottom with a nice, smooth coating of egg. Plenty of ghee, plenty of ghee. Now I'm starting to smell it browning. So what I do now is I layer the side. Mind you, this is my first ever omelet, so in case you see some lack of expertise, just bear with me here. Bear with me. Now, what I'm going to do is try to flip this a little bit. See if that works. What I've done here is <laughs> created. I actually forgot the cheese, so let's go ahead and peel it back. <laughs> I got some real nice cheese here. This is a ball of mushroom cheese. Now, See, the, the key to being a good cook is never give a saw how things went to shit just now. It's all right. You keep going. You keep going. You keep... Sometimes it's going to come out even better than if you'd done it perfect. Trust me on this. Trust me on this. Never give up. Never give in. Just allow it to continue. Things might look like they're totally ruined. They might look that way. That's what the devil wants you to think. You want you to keep on going, keep giving it all your good love and energy, and you just wait. You just wait. It'll look even prettier than a man who's proud of his skills who won't ever make any mistakes. So, here we are, just about done. Now, the key to a good omelet, a good balance, is you turn off the heat a little early. Excuse me there. And you put a lid on it and allow it to continue with no heat. Now, when that comes out, we will observe. And until then, I'm going to stress up my salad. Don't forget, always have a salad when you have animal products coming at you. Oh, welcome. Okay, so we let a few minutes go by. We discussed things. We've reviewed the video. It's actually turned out much better than we thought. And usually things do, as long as you continue. The lesson today is perseverance. If things look horrible, you keep going. So, I got a surprise for you. I got a beautiful looking omelet here. Beautiful. See that brown? See that brown? That's what I'm talking about. That's what people want to see. That's what old people want to see when they go to Denny's. They often don't because the people trying to cook there